Here we have the Dell 1525. And this is the auction that we've got. This is the item we have up for auction. Uh, as you see, the front edge of this laptop is very thin. Not much space at all between there. And headphone port, headphone port, microphone port, 8-in-1 card reader right there. Various lights indicating the standard stuff, hard drive activity, power, Wi-Fi, network connected, Bluetooth, and charge. And right here on the left side of the laptop, hard drive right here, that's 250 gigabytes, FireWire port, HDMI output, modem, uh, this is for telephone connection, and here's the Ethernet connection, and that's for like high-speed broadband. Here is VGA output, USB 1, USB 2, power supply, and uh, the security cable port. Back of the laptop, Dell avoided putting anything back there, as you see, successfully. There's nothing there except a vent. The purpose of that is so that you don't have to reach behind your laptop to plug stuff in and take stuff out, which is a pain. And here we have the right side of the laptop, a couple more USB connections right here, S-Video connection, DVD burner, and Wi-Fi catcher. That's a cool little feature where you can flip that on or off to catch Wi-Fi networks in your vicinity. And say the laptop's even turned off, you can still click that, and it'll show you whether there's a wireless network nearby. This is the um, Dell Street Racing cover. I really like this one. It's a glossy one, and uh, you'll find the glossy one does get smudges, but at the same time, it's pretty sleek. And as long as you wipe it down once a day or so, you're going to be fine. Uh, a couple little extra things. This is the Dell 6-cell battery, and um, we also include in this auction the 9-cell battery. As you see, it's significantly bigger, and it actually protrudes from the back of the laptop a little bit, but it's great for travel use for a uh, large storage capacity. I've noticed my 6-cell as a brand new Dell 1525. The 6-cell is lasting about four, four and a half hours, and the 9-cell is actually lasting about six, six and a half hours. Pretty good use of that. Oh, and right in here, we've got our four gigabytes of memory. This is a core duo, meaning two processor machine, and we have a total of uh, two gigahertz times two, so it's two two gigahertz processors. Here's the actual keypad, real nice keyboard, springy and responsive. Um, here's the actual media controls. You can press these, and they're not actually buttons. They like respond to your fingertips uh, to increase and decrease the volume, pause your music or movie or whatever. So that's a really neat little feature. Another neat feature is what they've got called Dell Media Direct. You press that on, you have instant access to contacts, DVDs, if you want to watch a DVD, calendars, uh, things like that, so that you don't have to boot your operating system to actually get to some of the vital information you'll need quick, or just to watch a movie, which is always a pain. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so here we have the desktop itself. And let me just go ahead and covertly input my password here out of the screen view. Not that I don't trust you guys, great. And see, look at this. Now I'm not even able to remember my own password. Okay, now there we got it. So now we're into our beautiful widescreen. This is the glossy screen. You can get glossy or anti-glare. The advantage, the advantage of um, the glossy is that it's a crisper image. The advantage of the anti-glare is you know, self-evident. You don't have that glare and that reflection, which you see like that overhead light there bouncing on and off of there. Now, not too often do I have my laptop pointed at the ceiling, so I don't have a problem with it. It's got Windows Vista Ultimate in here, and um, great wireless laptop. Another couple of little features, some really cool microphones right here, and a great camera. Let me just show you the quality of that camera, if we can do that quickly. Let's see, I just got this laptop in the other day, and I haven't had a hell of a lot of time to use it. I do enjoy it, but here we go. Dell Webcam. Let's open that up. And Dell Webcam Center. Let's see what the quality of that looks like. Video recording. Uh, start. Initializing camera, 
Well, as you see, pretty cool, huh? Uh, nice image. Well, I guess you can't see it as well as I can, but it's two megapixels and um, perfectly nice. Here's a, here's my hand coming in on that, and let's see if you can see that. Yeah, there we go. There it is on that itself. Okay, cool. Well, anyway, that's the webcam. Really nice for video conferencing. Captures uh, your voice quite well, too, which you'll notice if you did any recording with it. And that's pretty much that. Okay, well, if you have any other questions, feel free to email me. Um, otherwise, I um, appreciate you looking at this. I want you to know that any buyer who's purchasing my laptops um, is helping me with my funding of my book. This is the book that I wrote. It's my first one. It's self-published, Dragon Moon Rising, Daniel O'Connor for ages 8 through adult. Great book, and it's the first in a series. So let's help me write book two and uh, get this one promoted. This book is described very well in it, this uh, website, www.dragonmoonrising.com. Thanks a lot for looking at this auction, and again, uh, have a great day, and ask me any questions you want.